morning my name is yam narasimha rao lecturer in physics today i am explaining the relation between mu not epsilon not and c mu not represents the magnetic permeability of free space epsilon not represents the electric permittivity of free space small c represents the velocity of light in vacuum suppose if the charge is in a rest position if the charge is in the rest position around this charge around this charge electric field is produced electric field is produced suppose when the charge is in motion this charged particle it produces both electric field and also magnetic field we know that 1 by 4 pi epsilon not is equals to 9 into 10 power 9 Newton meter square per coulomb square. Now it is I am taking as equation number one. Equation number one. Now and one more thing, we are having one more formula. Mu naught is equals to four pi into ten power minus seven newton per. Ampere square, Newton per ampere square. Here, mu naught I am writing mu naught. Four pi comes to denominator by four pi. That is equals to ten power minus seven Newton per ampere square. Newton per ampere square. It is equation number two. Now dividing this equation one with this equation two, divide, dividing, dividing equation one with equation two. Now please listen here. Mu naught means permeability of a free space. Its definition is. the ability of the vacuum to support to the magnetic field mu not represents the magnetic permeability of free space its meaning is the ability of the vacuum to support to the magnetic field epsilon not represents the electric permittivity of free space it is the ability of the vacuum to allow the electric lines of force to pass through it those are the definitions of mu naught and epsilon naught dividing equation 1 with equation 2 what is equation 1 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught is equals to 9 into 10 power 9 One by four pi epsilon naught is equals to nine into ten power nine newton meter square per coulomb square. One by four pi epsilon naught is equal to nine into ten power nine newton meter square per coulomb square by by equation two equation two mu naught by four pi. mu naught by 4 pi is equals to 10 power minus 7 10 power minus 7 newton per ampere square 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught i am writing 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught mu naught by 4 pi it comes to numerator 4 pi by mu naught mu naught by 4 pi it comes to numerator it becomes 4 pi 4 pi by mu naught that is equals to 9 into 10 power 
9 into 10 power 9. It is a 10 power minus 7. It comes to numerator. It becomes 10 power plus 7. 10 power plus 7. Newton meter square per coulomb square. Newton meter square per coulomb square. Newton by ampere square. It comes to numerator. Ampere square by Newton. 4 pi, 4 pi cancel. 4 pi, 4 pi cancel. 1 by mu naught epsilon naught. Mu naught epsilon naught is equals to 9 into 10 power 9, 10 power 7. Bases are equal. Add the powers. 9 plus 7, 16. 10 power 16. Newton, Newton cancelled. Newton, Newton cancelled. We know one formula. Charge. Q is equals to I into T. I represents current. T represents a time. Q represents the charge. Charge unit is cooler. Charge unit is cooler. That is equals to. I means current. Current unit is ampere. Current unit is ampere. Time unit is second. Charge unit is coulomb. Current unit is ampere. Time unit is second. Coulomb is equals to ampere into second. Now, meter square. Meter square. Ampere square. I am writing ampere square by coulomb. Coulomb means, Coulomb means ampere into second. Coulomb means, Coulomb means ampere into second. Coulomb, Coulomb means ampere into second. Coulomb means ampere into second. Square, I am writing square. I am writing square. Ampere square, ampere square cancelled. This can be written as 1 by mu naught. Epsilon naught that is equals to this can be written as 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second whole square. 3 square 9. 10 I have 10 power 8 into 2. 8 to 2 the 16 meter square by second square equal. Now this I am writing as in this way. Now here, 9 I am writing as 3 square. 10 power 16 I am writing as 10 power 8 whole square. Meter square by second square. Meter square by second square. Now here, please listen here. Square, square cancelled. Square, square cancelled. Square, square cancelled. 1 by under root of mu naught epsilon naught. That is equals to 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second. Meter per second. 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second. It is nothing but velocity of light. Velocity of light in vacuum. Velocity of light in vacuum. Velocity of light in vacuum that is represented by C. Finally, we got, finally, we got C is equals to, C is equals to 1 by under root of mu naught epsilon naught where C represents the velocity of light. Velocity of light in vacuum. It is the relation between the velocity of light, magnetic permeability of free space, electric permeability of free space. Thank you.